around the world, many people fast. But what does fasting mean? Well, many people think we're starving ourselves. But fasting means when you abstain yourself from food or your desires. So once, once again, fasting is very important in many parts of the world, either religious or just a health person. Now there are many types of fasting. Now, first of all, there's a religious fasting, which we'll be covered soon. Now, there are also many types of uh, fasting for like the intermittent fasting, so such as the liquid fast, the 24-hour fast, uh, two time per week fast, get one meal and have two, because according to many researches, in the, uh, in, the, uh, in the past, people used to have two meals a day. And ever since the recent years, the population of America is now having about three meals a day. And there are many more. It's just how you want to fast. Now for the religions, a lot of religions participate in fasting, such as Islam. They do this in Ramadan, as you guys have done this for the class. You know, read if you did. So for Ramadan, you fast for 30 days from sunset to, sunri sunset to sunrise. Yeah. And then for Christianity, you also fast. But the difference between Christianity and Islam is in Islam you don't eat at all or drink at all. But in Christianity you can have fish and water. That's why fast food is, you know, people are buying fish burgers and probably next week it's going to be the most popular thing because uh, Lent begins soon. And Judaism, Yom Kippur is, is a day or two day of fasting for the Jewish, uh, Jewish followers and Buddhists. Many Buddhists don't do it, but only the monks. The monks uh, participate in fasting. And the Hinduism, the holy men, so like, we're just talking about the religious, like the holy people, they do fasting. And each of them fast differently. Such as Islam doesn't eat anything at all the whole day, and then Christians, they can have some type of meals. And Jews, they can have water or uh, food. And Buddhists, same thing, no food or water, and Hindu, the same thing. But it's not always about food, it's about self-control, such as harmful habits, such as smoking, cursing, um, drinking. It's also about thinking, it's, you also want to fast from thinking negative, because the goal is to become a better person within 21 days. According to many, re according to many research, it takes 21 days to build a habit, so within uh, 30 days of Ramadan, 40 days of Lent, and other holidays, uh, other religions that also participate in fasting. It is, uh, it is approved by many researchers that uh, fasting is not just for food, but it's also good for like desires, not to waste time, uh, not to be wasteful of food, and show people how um, are struggling around the world. According to Healthline, a popular website for health, it states 40% uh, of USA food is wasted each year, while one in six Americans don't even know where the next meal comes from. For instance, Harrisburg is about 30% poverty. So every time you come in, you should think about how many people do not have food here. So when you fast, you understand the importance of food. Um, I myself could fast for 16 hours and not be hungry or thirsty at all. Once again, uh, one billion uh, amount is spent yearly to dispose of food waste and 141 trillion calories are being wasted. That's a lot of calories you could have uh, used for someone who's um, hungry. Now it's not always about religion. You do not have to be a religious person, but it's also good for your health. For instance, it for blood it decreases your insulin and for your liver it increases your insulin sensitivity. For in uh, intestines it reduces energy uptake. For in brain, it increases your cognitive thinking. Uh, for heart, it reduces resting heart rate. For fat, uh, you lose, uh, it reduces your leptin and your muscle. It increases. For instance, when you're fasting, you're burning your body fat. But you're also, for instance, if you're like, if you can, you can also fast while drinking. So if you're like doing that type of fasting while you can just drink water, you're burning your body fat but you're also being hydrated. So you're not really like going to be you know, like low on energy. So what happens to your body when you, uh, when you don't eat for 16 hours? Well, once again, your, it stabilizes your insulin levels. It gives you more energy. Now, you wouldn't know if, unless you try it. So it lowers your, I mean, it prevents Alzheimer's, 
pretty much, it, uh, in summary, it, uh, it prevents diseases. So there are people that uh, participate in fasting, such as Hugh Jack, uh, Jackman and Miranda Kerr. So who can't fast? Not everyone is able to fast, such as those who are sick, those who are pregnant, those who are traveling, those who are elders, uh, those who are children before the age of puberty. Now that I've told you guys about fasting, I hope you know why fasting is very important in many parts of the world. 